Hello everybody, Darren here, and welcome back to Anno 1800. Now, in the last episode, we waged war on Arthur Gasparov and through brute force took all of his islands here in the New World. But while it's been going well in this theater, it hasn't been going as smoothly everywhere else. He's taken islands in Cape Trelawney, Mbesa, and he's coming pretty close with one of them in the Arctic and one of them in the Old World. So today, the war continues, and now I'm free to divide up my fleets between the different theaters to protect all of my islands and systematically start taking back and taking out his ones. Now, due to the real-time nature of the game, of course, we can't pause and issue orders and stuff, so bear with me. Of course, you really do have to have watched the previous episode to understand what's going on. I'm going to be hopping between theaters a lot while we try to orchestrate moving all our ships around, but I'll do my best to catch you up here in the first part of the episode about what's going on. So... We're in the New World, our ships are still here, time has not passed between episodes. These guys are going to go into grouped formation, get gathered together. These guys are going to head down towards this island which we just conquered to solidify the New World, Gasparograd, because it's got a little lone battleship heading towards it right now. So we're going to intercept that. They can't take it back for 25 minutes anyway, but we want to get rid of all of those little purple icons we see on the radar in this theater. Now, in the Old World, our little... Fleet ready. Bros down here are. Oh my god. I just saw that. Holy crap. Ugh. Oh my god, they're still attacking this place. That sucks. I'm just having a look on the radar all the time. We just got. They're doing bombing runs left, right, and center, and I can't quite catch up to them. So we have our dual saviors, the, the twin mining airships. The guys dropped the, the sea mines that protected. Oh my god, here comes another run. Holy crap. Holy crap! Jeez! Oh no! Oh no! You can't take an island just by bombing it, can you? I'm hoping not. We're just gonna have to try and maintain. They're just- they're straight out of here! What a tactic, man! He just flew right over, bombed it, and then bailed. Now, this was actually on a timer, but now it's gone below the flag, flag level, taking fresh damage. I wonder, actually, with time- whoops, sorry. Can I build... Uh, the Docklands version of the repair crane? would be nice. And then maybe it'll start repairing just little bits? Maybe. These guys could just have to protect it for a while. Now, they're both packing still a pretty um, good arsenal of sea mines. 60 on these and 60 on their ship. Both of them dropping five at a time, I believe, when they want to go actually attack. We've got repair cranes over here. We're going to send these guys up there. Um, something else. In the new world, we should have just finished the world championship. I think we have. So all of us can see. And that's going to be 150 influence straight off the bat yet again, which, what we're going to do with that... Let's just take out this guy. Uh, we're going to use that influence to get more ships, more airships, and get them just constructed in the background for a while. Alright, keep chasing him. We'll check back in a second. So our airships are being made already, actually, here, which is good. What are you missing now? Helium? Uh-oh. Don't even, I can't even begin to think about that right now. Um, and then the other one is in the Your old world. From its we want to get some fresh battleships on the go. Speaking of battleships, I believe a battleship has just entered this theater now as well. Mm, maybe? Yep. Oh my god. They're actually attacking. Holy crap. We gotta bring in another sea mine run on these guys. Come on, keep the battleship alive. Guns blazing. I think we've done it. Island's still okay, just barely. Holy crap, man, he really threw the heat down on this one just there last second. Again, those guys came in absolutely clutch. Now, we've got these repair cranes. Are they working yet? They actually are, so let's just get in over there, get protected. Wow. I'm just looking on the radar again to see what else does he have. Regular airships, some sort of frigate, I think. He's got the crew of... Oh my god, that's like really kind of scary, actually. And then we still have to check Tabarim. Right, so, we have a new battleship that's just arrived here. It's on its own. It's going to heal. Down at our docks, we're making two more. Then, we're going to go to Embesa. Here is where we have our airship fleet. And they're protecting this island. Now, these guys I don't really think have anything on them. They've got some bombs, and that's it. I... That seems to be it. We can't let them do anything again, because the island that they are going to doesn't exist anymore. 
And then we're just getting shot as we pass by different things. Now, in Embesa, he still has pockets of ships. A lot of airships, I'm noticing. So really do need to sort out that helium issue so we can make sure we keep up construction. One of your routes is a major issue. All right, let's head down to Marbella, which I'm hoping has some helium. He's defeated the island of Donabate here in Cape Trelawney. That's another problem as well. We need to get here soon. Actually... This fleet is now going to go to Cape Trelawney. Crown Farms, please. We have eradicated... This is the new world. We've taken out everything that belonged to him here. So we should be safe to leave. We'll come back if we really need to. Or send a few sh ships back when we have more. But for now, they're going to head straight to Cape Trelawney. And hopefully stay together. These guys, you're going to Mbesa. The hell out of my face. Alright. In the old world, we're just going to hopefully make ships here and try to hold on to the islands we have with our various sea mines and stuff. Is that ours? That's ours. All right, let's brighten up the date. We're climbing back up, by the way. The repair cranes are doing work. And once two minutes go by, then we're free to actually repair things properly. All right, good stuff. My god, the chaos of it all. Um, right, so, helium. That's what we were doing. <laughs> let's get that sorted. So I think there's helium down here. I could just double check by going into construction, scrolling down. Yeah, the 611. So we'll just grab that helium, bring it back up so we can make some fresh ships. Now, I would have thought you can make airships in the old world, but I had a quick look around, and I can't see where he's making them right now. So maybe we could just quickly look around again ourselves. We'll check the old world first, right? We'll go island by island. We're looking for a big airship hangar. If we, could, if we could find that, that would give us the answer to everything. Workforce shortage. Oh, stop. I'm not seeing it. Benty's Island? Shortage. My god, look at this. Aye. There's so Work many. What are we on, shortage. by the way? Active defense. They're just flying over. Oh my god, they're dropping propaganda. Work no. <laughs> Poor Rush. You know, all the leaflets being told that they've got no escape. It's like Dunkirk. Holy crap, man. And they're, oh my god, the battle has begun. We've just got two little ships here. We're gonna have to blast them all down and hope that our items will carry us. They need to get the hell out of here. I don't think my airships are gonna make it. No, I was trying to get it over the thing. It's gonna go down. It's down. So is theirs. But we've got... It's like a 1v4 situation. Oh my god, it's over. Uh-oh. We need to go pick up that stuff as well. Engines underway. We need to get these guys. Oh my god, they actually dropped the item on the... Uh, on land. Now, they're Where actually bailing out of here. When I need them? He couldn't defeat an island. Okay. <laughs> well, we just lost the two amazing ships, but don't worry, the heroes that were on board have survived. Now, in order to pick up the, that item, we'll have to fly over with our airship and get it. Could I maybe Sky's just drop that stuff in here for now? We'll take this route around. And then let me know when you're there. And we'll pick up those guys that are trapped on land, which is... I've actually never really seen that before. Aye. How did we do? Picked up most of what he needs, but not, don't need the fur. So we've got equipped in airships, the airship technician, and the airship cargo loader. Now, because we repaired all this... God damn, get it repaired quickly <laughs> before the attack continues. <laughs> oh, they dropped the sea mines as well. There we go, we got the guy. That's, imp that's the important thing. Alright, well we technically did it, but I feel really bad that we lost those ships because they were historic ships that have saved islands like three times now. Plus in Embesa, we have our other air fleet. We could send them... We could send them now. I think we'll do it. These guys will go back to the old world then. Try to get to the Knoll, which is on the edge of the map. All right, so these guys are off. Muscle crackers reach this destination? No, it doesn't. The fire left ruins behind. I mean, think about it. It's just going to get blasted out of the air if we're not careful. He's propaganding so brave swords as well so now. Many lives saved. I just want to get these items before on they go way. away completely. Island's un island under attack again. Holding firm, though. What'll it be? We picked up 
a bottle of champagne, and some sea mines. Oh, we got the guy. We got the guy. Great. Engines engaged. Um, hmm. Yeah, you just stay there, I guess. We really do need some guns or something that can fire up at those guys here. The fire left ruins behind. What do we have? Flak emplacements. All right. See, we didn't have the influence before. Now we do. All right, four flak guns. So this police should be fairly well defended then. All right, what else is the problem right now? That's destroyed. Can't do anything about it. That's destroyed. A fire broke oh my god, they even bom bombed this place. And the New World as well. Its bomb production is actually offline. Holy crap, they targeted the military it. factories. Oh my god, the economy. Don't even don't Work even look at it. Shortage. How are we doing for the helium? Let's drop it off. Let's just keep making ships. Military ships, please. 15 minutes, and these take... I think they take 15 as well, but they might take 20. Ready We've got one action. here. You get to Mbesa. Now, have my airships arrived here yet? Not yet. There they are. Four of them on the way up. All right, good. Oh my god. All right, how are we doing in the Arctic, actually? Because he was firing up on this island and it was actually close to losing. I feel like we do need something here. What do we have here? We just have the flak cannons. Oh my god. Yeah, fresh battleships have to come up this way. <laughs> it's such a big divide. Look at this. Oh my god. No. Do we have anything that can shoot that down? Oh, I don't know. Can you build the air defenses on glaciers? The block like... simply had to come down. I don't know. Can you? I'm not seeing anything. Oh my god. Is there anywhere here that you could build it I out in the water, no? With a coarse air. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think Look so. You swagger. Oh, I'm swaggering. Where did we do? We just sank a ship here in the New World. Or in the Arctic. Good. I guess it was some of our defenses that did the work. We don't really have anything that can deal with these guys. We've got cannon items. And improved holes. So these two have cannons. Fire your cannon. That's a decent hit. These are just flat guns. I don't think they actually shoot against things like that. All right. The fire left ruins behind. Still waiting on the airships. There they are. They're coming in now. All right, cool. We got access to them. Let's just fly safely over our own territories as we make our way Fleet on the move. this way. These ships are, are absolutely battered. You need to just pause, heal, and then I can free you up and let you leave. So this one, for instance. So I'll have to just do that every now and then. Just tell them to go repair, and then once they're kind of healed up and just waiting, and put them back on the route. Oh, don't give me the what sad music. Even this ship is after taking a beating. Holy crap. Everyone just get on the... Uh, Airship there. <laughs> Lift we'll put them on these fresh ships that are coming in. <laughs> this is awesome. The music makes it. All right. Back to the new world. Any new ships made? We just have... Uh, nope. Everything's good. So we're still waiting on this to crank them out. And our ships that are on the way to Cape Trelawney and, 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 and Besa. Let's see where they are. So... The six that are arriving to Embesa, just about there. That's the old school fleet. And the rest of them that are arriving to Cape Trelawney look like they're there now. Yes, sir. All right, we are in. Moving to coordinates. Okay, good. Everyone just get together, stay together if you can. Fleet moving in convoy. And we could go straight for this island if we wanted to. The 19th of May. What was the 19th of May? The, the release date of the game? <laughs> Maybe. We could go straight for that. I don't see why not. Our ships are actually damaged coming in. I think it's because their items 
don't take effect in transit, but once they get back into a session, a new instance is created of the ship and it resets its hull, uh, hull strength down to its base level and then applies the items. Fleet awaiting orders. Seems to be what's happening anyway. What do you reckon? What's the defenses he's got here? I'm seeing two... a flak emplacement. Uh, two flak emplacements, two light guns, and a cannon at the back. No big betty or anything like that, so I think we're good to go. Fleet en route. All right, Embesa. The fire left ruins. Let's just take this island, seeing as we're crossing its path anyway. Basically, did that automatically. Like you do anything, you will turn majesty into a monstrosity. These guys barely have any defenses at all, so we'll just head down and take that out. I see you're exploring yet more islands. You're fine. All right, the castaway is here now as well. Tabarim is actually taking a bit of a beating. They must have gotten um, bombarded. Again, maybe another repair crane here would be good. Seems like it's necessary. Oh. <laughs> I'm having a great fun with this. It's so hectic, I feel like, at least in my head. It's got some ships out here hanging out on the edge. Left ruins behind. established. All right, this should be an easy one. And we'll just wrap our way around Tabarim. Or it's not Tabarim, and em Embesa to get to Tabarim. Go that way. Send you out as well. You can see the fleet in the distance. That's where we're headed. She likes that I'm expanding faster than her. This is all for you, Benty. Work all of it's going to go to you. <laughs> or a lot of it might might do. Moving to coordinates. We still have the pirate flags in these ships, actually. Not that we need them. Is that a clipper? Don't I haven't seen a clipper in a long time. Established. Light it up. I love the fire service. They help me a lot. You're going to love this, Benty. <laughs> wow. Alright, we're going to sail around the corner, so go there, and then go here. And our airship is on the way. Okay. Airship's going to 1v1 that ship, he'll take him out, no problem. Well, what's behind us here? Two frigates, is it? We could turn to go for the frigate first, we actually go with the wind then, anyway. Yeah, his airship's backing off, we're going to send the airship back to Tabarim though, we'll go with the wind around this way. And uh, hit into those guys. Okay, so Cape Trelawney, how are we doing? The fire left ruins behind. I'm a little nervous that some of them have low health bars, but I think it's just because their items haven't taken effect. Some of them are actually healing as well. The 19th of May. Well, it's the 18th of February as a recording, so <laughs> we'll see how that goes. All right, unleash everything, please. Oh, the blue flames are coming out now. Looks good, man. Is any of our ships low? I didn't see if any of them got destroyed. I kind of looked away for a second. Forgot about the repair boxes we have as well. I think that's basically it for all the defenses. The two, four guns are taking out the fifth gun there, and then it's just the back gun here. Does he have to, um, defenses other way? No? Just surprised how much health it has, considering I'm not really seeing anything else that we can shoot. Just peers. Harbor master office, I guess. Light it up. Not seeing anything for creating ships here. It must be on this island, which seems to be the biggest. He does have a ship harbor thing there. Not seeing one for battleships, though, like the big steam one. That might be coming from the old world where his capital is. All right, I think that's enough. Can we, uh, can we wrap this up? There we go. See you later. I don't care about the items. I'm not here for that. I suppose expansion is always good.
God, what did they do to deserve that, you know? Nothing. Alright, back to Mbesa. Our fleet seems to have taken care of that issue, so we're gonna go here and then here. Alright, Cape Trelawney. That's all fine by me, whatever. So we'll just head back back over to that area and then hopefully maybe we'll go up to Where all right, this... are my muses when I need them. This place just got protected Workforce actually, so shortage. that's good. Can't actually repair that. What are we missing? Steel beams, yikes. Whew. Alright. Moving to coordinates. Alright, Arctic time. How's it going here? Standelsbreen seems okay. Everything seems okay. Hopefell seems okay. There's a little ship here. Little gunboat, is it? I think. Alright, that's fine. As long as we're keeping it all safe. No big deal. Don't trust me. Back to the old world. Haven't checked here in a while. So, what's the sitch? So we've got another battleship has been made. And we have our air fleet. Stations. Yeah, the island's holding firm again. It's under attack yet again. Just trying to think. So this battleship. We're making another one as well. We'll have a fleet of three soon, but we got, we got to send them to the Arctic. And we need to go pick up some sea mines and things Hi. as well. Alright, let me fly over here. We're going to transfer some of these items together. We're going to move the battleship up this way and around that way. So I'm just holding shift to queue up the orders in case people are wondering. These are good to get back on their routes now. And so are you. New orders. You're all healed, so just continue doing what you're doing. Right, so, you, go on to that. Everyone takes an Where additional commander. When I need them. Oh, you've already got people. Holy crap. Okay, cool. Alright, you're done. You've got two of the same. This doesn't need anyone. This is just Ready a big storage fly. thing that I'm using. Alright, cool. Workforce so they're good short. to go now. So that's number four. All combined. You don't have anything on you though, right? Just some bombs. A few bombs, not many. Now, I think I left some sea mines in here if I picked them up, I think. Let me just double check that. I did. About 50. Let's just transfer them to one of these. Engines engaged. Not going to divide it up equally. I'd rather just have one ship do it. Alright, we'll fly over there. They're destroying the tourism part of the town. It's terrible. Cape Trelawney. Moving to coordinates. All right, maybe go for this island next, seeing as it's really small. What's it called? Aeon's Paradise. Aeon's Paradise. Paradise. Fleet en route. Get to about there, and then I'll check back in with them. All right. A lot of moving around, but looking good. So battleship is now fighting. We have. This guy has the sea mines and the regular bombs. We'll give the bombs to someone else. This thing moving. He's moving fast. Go. That's not even fast enough. Holy crap, he's going so fast. There. He's going with the wind. Oh! <laughs> the turn. He's bobbing and weaving, goddammit. That's not going to be good enough. This is so much easier when they just went in dead straight lines like last time. Delivering payload. Your people are miserable. Your people are miserable. Drop another payload here, that'll finish him off. Arguably too many, I don't know why I did that so many, but there we go. Should be able to take down both of these, but if he brings more with them, we're screwed. The block simply had to come down. I don't know why it wasn't moving the rest of the fleet. They're coming over now. Bring them down. 
Oh yeah, they're running now. <laughs> We're prepared. The chase. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Everyone, everyone, chill. Let's get back together. Chase that down. Chase down that big fat, that big fatty fatty. Property of Gasparov. This must look so cool down on the ground. Oh my god! Oh, there we go. Oh, the humanity! <laughs> oh, the firefighter has a quest, no shit. <laughs> That's cool. All right, we're doing it. I'm hanging on. Hanging on to my islands, making fresh ships. That's the important thing. So this one that's just made, when's the next one coming? Uh, not for another seven minutes. Just keep another one as well after that. To your stations. So I think you're free to kind of meet up with your buddy now. Battle cruiser on the warpath. And these islands seem okay. Swords is okay. Everything's okay. Good. Right. New world. I'm guessing some airships have been made. One of them has. You're going to head to Mbesa to meet the, up with your friend, and then we'll go send them probably both to the Arctic, actually, soon. Workforce shortage. Just trying to make sure everything's okay up here. It seems like it. Cape Trelawney, then. All right, let's continue. I'm only seeing four defenses plus the uh, thing itself. Ruins behind. Got to check out some of these um, ruins and fires and issues that are going on right now. On the moon. All right, light him up. Where are my muses when I need them? I love the blue fire. I don't recall seeing that in the previous episode. Maybe I just forgot. All right, just the one left to go. And then we have uh, Nate's kind of island over there. What's it called? Does he have a name for it? Forget our you will never Sal Magundi. You know, he's probably right. I probably won't really appreciate it. Now, what's over on this one? Same sort of thing. It's kind of on the way to get it, get to the defenses. So we'll just head that direction. I'll just place down now some of the Docklands repair cranes, if I can. Although we don't have any steel. Crap. It's such a silly problem to have. I don't know if I can make any here. It's so hard to even think about logistics and items and what we make in these different places. Not only is the game so expansive and massive now, I'm in a war. can't really think about it. There's got to be... I feel like the regular repair ones don't require that, right? They do. All right, we'll have to make a delivery of steel if we want to get some repairs going here. Otherwise, we're screwed. Yep. All right. Anyone free? You, the muscle cracker, you can go pick up some steel and send Sky's it south, right? Limit. You can get out of the map just fine. I have no doubt. We won't give them too much. Just enough to build one or two repair things. So you're just about 50. Don't want to slow them down too much. All right, so you're going to go here, way. then here, and then let me know when you're there. Uh, you're not repairing. Is there a reason for that? This thing moving. There we go. Great. All right, looking a lot better. Continue your routes. Let's just see if anyone is not doing what they should be. Ah, everyone's on the route. You're definitely not at your position Guys, yet. Oh, they have notified me for the position, the the waypoint. I guess that makes sense. All right, our battleships are together now here in the old world. Yeah, the fleet is building. Good. Embesa. Haven't looked in a while. Forgot about them completely. <laughs> Alright, we're going to come down here and then cross in. 
In this place, what do we got left? Bird's Eye is okay. It's just struggling. Everything's going to be struggling because they did take an island and that l cut off a bunch of our... One of our products are unique fertilities that we were getting here. I don't know what it was. Was it the uh, the indigo, maybe? No? Must be something. Because we have chilies on the other island, and I can't imagine it was teff grass. Oh, it was probably the river slots for clay. Something like that. I don't know. Can't remember. But that's a good thing. I have, I have all the old saves, so I can just go back and see what those islands were doing, and then repair everything. Wow, there is a lot of damage here. All right, they're all fixed. The rivers are back online. Good. Benty has bought shares back from Arthur. You Good on you. I... Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Your ship has returned from its the ship is really damaged. Get the hell out of there. I say that. It actually has 2,000 hit points, so it's a lot better than it seems. Stations. Alright, almost done. Just sending the last ones in. This is the one with the big cannon. It always gets the job done. Two influence for that island. <laughs> Alright, good. Are you attacking? Trying to attack one of my other ones now? So, old world, we have the iron. He's made it. The steel, rather. So get to Cape Trelawney, head straight to Crown Farms, deliver that steel, we'll build a repair crane, those guys can repair, and then we can take on the bigger island. Oh, a lot of work to be done. How's that um, battleship coming along? It's almost ready. One minute to go. They can go join these two. And these airships that are here, these guys are ready to go as well. Start getting out there. Now, do they have sea mines? They do have a little bit. Tempting now that the air is kind of clear for a while. Send them to the Arctic. I think the Arctic's going to need help. Or it'd be good to just clear out the place for a bit. Now that we've battleships here, I'm not too worried about losing this place. And we built the air defenses, so a little bit better. Then we'll take this island. This is Benty's home. This is where she started. This was, I think... I can't quite remember, but I think this is Margaret Hunt's island, was it? And this would have been Benty's, and then this was always Arthur's, and then this was mine. That would be the four together. I think so. I don't quite remember it being straight across from Margaret, though. Maybe we were. Alright, I'm just going to delete that, and we'll scroll through things that need to be rebuilt. So um, there's a hotkey for runes. For most people, it's J, I think. For me, it's backspace. And then I just press U to upgrade. And to rebuild. So they need the steel to get rebuilt. Fleet ready. I'm trying to intercept some of these ships that are just coming by us. Don't want them picking off my weakened ones. Fleet on the move. I wonder what the best loot I've left behind is, you know, in terms of items that we could have maybe picked up. The scary thing is, a lot of the items I've made have been made in the Research Ooh, Institute. Sorry. And I feel like if I was to lose them on ships, then it, it, you don't get that... You know the way it gets more expensive every time you develop one? You don't get that cost reduced. So you could permanently, like... You could you could lose these items for good if you lose them and never pick them back up. Just gonna head this way real quickly. Stay individual for now. Fleet on the move. Oh yeah, the whole thing was there was a battle for Cape Trelawney, wasn't there? Forgot about that. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Muscle crackers here. All right, great. So we'll just pop down a wrong thing. Oh, I forgot. I could have brought things in through Docklands actually. Nice repair crane, just right there and right there. There we go.
All right, done. So we'll just fly up here. By the time we get there, we'll start repairing. Once the ships are repaired, we're going to go retake Drumcondra, which I named, retake Donna Bait, and then push our way down to Tabula Rasa, and then push our way down to the Big Island, which is definitely making ships. So just to kind of orientate you, if you couldn't see the radar, this is our island here of Cran Farms. I'm going to retake Drumcondra, hop over to Donna Bait, hop over to Tabula Rasa, and then Insula Sublimi. And that'll be most of the islands then taken, the biggest ones anyway, in Cape Trelawney. But of course then we will rotate back around this way, follow along the coast, or the Just edge of the map I should say. We'll get to this one, take out Quintessensk, or whatever, what is it? Quintessensk. He's got some airships flying around here. Scroll around, and we'll just cu we'll curl our way around the map, taking out all these little bits. And once the island's done, then we can leave. But this will take a while, because there's so many little ones, you know. Alright, at least they're in position, so... Embesa. Let's cut in and start taking this out now. The Arctic. Has, have we arrived in the Arctic yet? We just about have, actually. We've just arrived now. Your people are rioting. Ah, see, something is... Oh, they're out of um, coal. Fleet en route. Yeah, we need to fix that. That's a real big issue. I'm not really too sure why they're out of coal. I'll have to check the coal route that goes around the globe, because I feel like it should still be reaching here. There's a lot of ships on it. So I've got some sea mines that I basically... Forget oh, cool. That was the one in Mbesa, I think. <laughs> <never fully> <laughs> yeah. I <laughs> wasn't even looking at it. All right, we can just go straight for the next one. So I can't attack him, but and if he's not going to move, we could just drop some mines right on him. It's as easy as that. Good job. Got 14 left. That's basically three more runs. We've got something hum coming over here. Fleet moving in Take some shots. Slow him down. Oh, do you not quite reach him? I guess not. Fleet embarking. We're catching up to him now. There you go. Fleet moving in convoy. Well, that's strange. <laughs> Carrying gardens on his airship, but okay. What else do we have? We've got another one. Let's take him down. Try to intercept him. If we go this way, we'll actually cut with the wind. When we cut south. But so will he, I guess. But we'll see how it goes. There we go. We're firing on him now. He's heading towards our Fleet island. Maybe I'll just stay. Oh yeah, the flak monitors should destroy. They're all firing up at him as well. Good. Fleet en route. Come on now. There we go. All right. I'm confident, relatively confident now. Oh no, there's still some air in this place. Okay, so I'll just go to the middle of the map, move over there. We'll check back in in a second. Get to Embesa. We're just going to come down and take this island now. He has really no defenses here at all, so it should be easy enough. Attention for the Admiral. Let's line up like that. All right, in Cape Trelawney, we should be relatively healed, I would imagine. Let's get you in there. Let's get you in there. Let's get you in there. The block simply had to come down. Can't actually remember what's going on here. We have our third battleship, though. The third one has just come out. 
frigates are attacking me. It's not a big deal. All right, once they've been had their orders queued up as well. So we're pretty much ready to start really taking these islands now a lot faster here in Cape Trelawney and in Mbesa. Forget our, you will never fully appreciate it. Two frigates on the inbound. Next so let's just back off with them. them I know. <laughs> Fleet ready. Let's go with these guys. Two frigates, not a big problem. I was really worried there at the beginning of this episode because when he came in swooping in with those airships, just making bombing runs on some of my biggest islands, I was like, oh my god. Even with flak in place, I'm not going to be able to, 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 to be able to deter that. But it seems like it's okay. All right, we're going to be going straight with the wind, but so will they. I'll tell my guys to go individual, and we'll just head straight for the repair cranes. A fire broke out. And we'll get my frigate to do the same. If they want to turn, they can turn. Uh, they've made a mistake. Indecisive. I will choose when to scrap my work. Stations. All right, we'll pick that up, and we'll just keep going to the repair cranes. Awesome. All right, great. Hey, get the hell out of here. <laughs> a renowned personage has arrived. Oh my god, imagine I didn't see that and he just bought, like, either Tabarim or, like, s swords or something. Could have been bad. Nice. I love this port. It looks great. Fleet awaiting orders. So where's his things? They're here. I just don't want to be in range of any flak, so we'll come down and see if we can engage him around this area. Three airships. Fleet embarking. Just stay right around there. He's not committing to it. Cape Trelawney, are we healed? We're almost healed. Stations. This one's just going to take a little while, this guy. It's because he has the extra hull. 40% extra hit points, that's a lot. Hit points plus 800 then with the captain. Hit points 30% with the plate heated exchanger. Wow, yeah, it's thick. So what can it go up to, 12,000? 11 and a half. Battle deck to attention. Without any increased hit points. So the standard is 6,000, wow. It's Ready almost got action. twice that. I reckon just get moving now though, I'm impatient. All right, let's go. Your people are starting to get sick. Yeah, that's terrible. <laughs> Someone should do something about that. Fleet en route. Fleet on the move. I oh, should be able to take them down, no problem, as long as you just focus fire one at a time. I was actually bringing my flak monitors out here just to help, but I don't Aye. think I need to. Now, does he have an airship hanging here? I still don't know where he's making these. <laughs> where are they coming from? Maybe the island in the bottom right of this map, or in the right side, sorry. I'm just going to right-click them, that should be handled. Ready. These guys can pretty much go back home. And then what do we have? This one here? Ah, there it is. There it is. So yeah, we need to get that airship. We really need to take that out, actually, because that's probably where all his fleets are coming from, from the, in the air, and they're so annoying. So as soon as we're done in... I suppose it'll take a while, but Mbesa or Cape Trelawney will send those fleets up here to deal with that. He actually took out two of my um, cargo ships here. Hi. The little sister's still okay, though. All right, good. So he's a little island here. Don't have to worry about that. Fleet embarking. Now, we've been making bombs in New Rome, in uh, the New World, for a while. Maybe I could just come over and just do a massive bombing run. Maybe. Hmm. Let me see. So, New World, we have a ship here, and there's another one. Oh, my God, we're not making one. Get made. Ready for orders. 
You need to go up and pick up the bombs. How many bombs are here? 191. Hell yeah. You could even get our old style airships just to deliver the payloads. That'd be interesting. Doesn't need to be war airships. Although ideally you want to come in fast and get out fast with the other ones. He's actually creeping in on the edge of the map with some gunboats. He's got a gunboat there, an airship here, an armed airship, and another one there. <laughs> interesting. Waiting for the right moment, I guess. Alright, we're gonna come around, circle the corner, and take start taking out this island. Left ruins four behind. to go in Cape Trelawney. Four big well actually really just one big one in Cape Trelawney, then a lot of a lot of small ones. Alright, in base says the next place to look. And Tabarim seems safe, so I'm just gonna keep circling around clockwise, so we'll head down this way first. Fleet moving in convoy. All right, so we'll leave them to do their thing. The airship's here. I'm going to send them to the New World. We'll deal with that little, those little guys that are coming in. Go to Manola. You've done a great job. A great service. We're prepared. And you're here to pick up some bombs, along with the other guys, too. Bombs and sea mines. So, a bit of both. Bit of both. Great, you're ready to go. What is received? Just brighten it up a little bit. All right, so we're just gonna wait for the other fleets to kind of arrive, and then we'll send these all out together as a package. We could probably defeat the ones on the edge, maybe mine the, throw mines down at the guys in the water or something. I'm sure no, a lot of routes no, have a major issue. Oh, one of the oil fleets was taken out. I forgot, since changing my oil route to not just deliver everywhere and deliver to individual islands, um, Why oh my god, this is... Eat? Stop, don't worry about it, hey! <laughs> Chill with the bomb making, yeah? You'll be happier. You can calm down the riots, don't worry about it. It's wartime, this stuff happens. I'm not gonna fix it. Right now. The tourism boat is just like, yeah, you don't want to go anywhere. You don't want to be here right now. There's nothing to see. Except death. My three battleships are together. For the fourth on the way. Fleet fourth one is actually just pretty much ready to go. What's the news? Oh, come on. Enemy tramples through city. I don't think so. I'm Stop with that. Is there anything that can give me... Um, what does this do? Attack speed. Oh, my God. 135. Influence for attack speed 30%. Let's go with 20% because I'm not sure how much influence I... Oh, I have 112. Okay. Yeah, let's do this. Attack speed, 20%. It's Boom. A different perspective. Are you a coward? Then you must surely feel the guilt. As our soldiers lead us to triumph and glory, I you slouch on the couch. Thank you enough for saving our publishing house. Quite in your undergarments. How frightening you can be. Yeah, you're damn right. You gained in the name of justice. Bonus. So I gained an influence bonus, presumably Shift in propaganda. What does that give us? Newspaper effectiveness is also increased, so then that's even stronger, the attack speed thing. God, there's so many things that have been destroyed. You're trying to take out Malahide, I didn't even know. Right, where were we? So, Mbesa, actually, let's go Cape Trelawney first. Oh my god. I have to stop doing that, looking away last second. Workforce Hopefully they'll make it out of there. Everyone else can keep going. You just get back to... I hope I didn't lose the ship. I wasn't paying attention. Right, go back there. I feel like I did. This doesn't seem like as much as it was before. But I feel like I... There we go. There we go. I was going to say, I'd see the items on the ground or something, you know? Something. Alright, the flames are offline. That's the important one to take out. Alright, we're taking it no problem. Easy. You, will never fully appreciate it. you guys are all here now together. We can put you on number four again. 
Uh, just the airships, please. Oh, it's so awkward. Fleet ready. There we go. All right, so some of you can take extra stuff. Good. Still haven't actually used the propaganda yet. The block simply had to come down. He's destroyed one of my buildings. All right, we're going to travel as a group and go for that one right there. Once we've taken out a couple of those ships, we'll leave this place. When's the next airship getting made? Where are my muses when I need them? He couldn't defeat an island of mine. Good. Back to the old world. That extra battleship is here now. And they're all Attention, almost the together. Gonna hotkey them as well for a little bit. Let's see, where could we go that we could take out? I feel like I can't retake really anything when it's just four battleships with no extra items on them. But they should be able to protect the waters for a while. Maybe put a blockade in. Yeah, I tell you what, we could patrol them. I won't do it right now, but we'll just get them in between swords and rush and patrol them kind of along this way so they just fight anything they need to. All right, Cape Trelawney. So that place is safe. And Besa, we're on the edge now, ready to creep around to this island. How's Tabarim? Tabarim safe? This island safe? Bird's eye safe? Rock Lobster? All safe. Alright, we're going with the wind. Should be nice and fast as we creep around this one little thing here. It doesn't have much defenses. Fleet moving in convoy. Stay together as well if you can. Moving to coordinates. Oh my god, they just went for the bridge and the farm and stuff. <laughs> That's so harsh. Look at that health bar. My god, that was quick. Okay, good. Let's get them moving on to the next one now. Amazing, you know what to do with them all. Just gonna take some of these damage ships out of here and then just regroup these guys. So I don't accidentally use them by mistake. All right, we're going to pull over to here. They should take that themselves without me even having to really tell them. But I think you can queue it up. So we'll see how that goes. All right, what else was I doing? It's hard to keep track. Oh, yeah. The New Worlds. We were just fighting their airship. Ours are moving very slowly because they're packing a punch with all the bombs and stuff. Maybe we'll come in and do a bombing run in some of the um, Old World Islands actually and help those battleships take them. I think we'll have to do that because we're not going to be able to catch these guys. So you just leave, head to the Old World, maybe get to... Oh, he's turning around. Oh, no, he's not. All right, let's go to Lusk. It's on the edge. So, plan with them is to arrive in the here. Left ruins behind. Maybe do a bombing run in something like this place or, yeah, some smaller places and these battleships can then take it out. Or actually, maybe we'll try to retake Benty's Island. I feel like a bombing run can do it. So that's what we'll do. Please Tell these guys to wait right here. And they'll come in when they're needed, when the airships come in first. Good. Attention for the Admiral. Thank God. If they dropped mines, oh my God. <laughs> so far, they never have, so we're safe. Fleet en route. I don't even know what I just oh, took. What did I take? I want my damned island back. You will never fully appreciate it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great. Fleet embarking. All right, now so what do you got left? Islands than me. You still have that big one over there. This is still repairing. Repair row. So what has he got left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in Cape Trelawney. basically all but over now and just a few big islands left to go the biggest one being his capital in the old world which is rocking a big betty thing so we'll have to bomb that if we can before we try to take it are you finally embracing a just cause uh kind of Stations. Right, these guys can rejoin actually so we'll wait to attack before they rejoin go back to Mbesa. let's curl in i think he actually has a defense here does he nope just the one thing Going against the wind Workforce with this one. Shortage. 
Yeah, I'm worried about the Arctic, but he hasn't actually taken anything here. Flak monitors are still in place just in case you get attacked by air. Everyone's cold and starving and dying. I guess they're out of coal. There's no... Oh, I tell you what was the... What's probably the problem is the airships have all been taken out here, so they're not getting their deliveries anymore. That's what it is. I was wondering, like, why has this stopped? But the coal deliveries are probably fine. Coal is still here, technically, although not in great amounts. Yeah, it'll take a while for me to look into that. But I assume that's what's going on, that the airships have not made their delivery. Hi. This has been here for a while as well. What's, what is it? Forget art, you will never fully appreciate it. I suppose expansion is always good. Helix of Suffer. We'll probably get Embasa done for this episode. That'd be good to do. So then we can say we did New World last one, Embasa this one. And then the next one we should finish him off completely. That'd be the goal. He hasn't actually recaptured anything yet either. Alright, we'll just target that. Cape Trelawney, are these guys ready to go yet? Uh, we're getting there. Let's go this way. It's really only a matter of time. We're negative 37 on the influence now, though. That's propaganda for you. <laughs> the fact that we keep taking all these islands. We won't be able to make any new ships, though. Stations! Your ship has returned from its voyage. All right, we're here. We're ready to do our bombing run, which we're definitely going to do. Just trying to think. We want to come in from the side, over the mountains, perhaps, and then we'll come in with some bombs. Just roll straight over, and queue up a few of our ships to do the same. There's a lot of frigates here and stuff as well, and our battleships are just waiting on the edge. <laughs> we'll get them all in position. The Embassy Islands fall so quick, Our, as did ours, to be fair. It'd be really cool, in the old Anno games, the way war used to work is you had to make the weapons, and make the military packs, and you'd send units onto islands and stuff. It'd be quite cool if you had to make the munitions to supply your ships and stuff. As long as you preserve what's already there. I like the idea of like war economies and war logistics and stuff like that. So. Workforce transfer disrupted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, are the airships ready? Your streets are safe again. Oh no, they're very slow, of course. They're going against the wind and they're also packing like big payloads. Where are my muses when I need them? Neutral buoyancy achieved. I don't know where that guy's gonna go. It's gonna hit straight into a. It doesn't matter. Fleet awaiting orders. Drop whatever you can quickly. There you go. Fleet en route. Just a bit of damage. <laughs> Just to let him know who's boss. All right. So defenses-wise, what do we got? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, and then the building itself. They're hitting us Work as we go by. Disrupted. So the idea is to get our bombers, fly straight over. We'll tell them individually to do it as well. Not our bombers. So yeah, yeah, sorry, our bombers, not sea mines. Get this thing moving. So you're packing bombs. Your bombs as well. So are you. This one doesn't have any. All right, let's just do it. Set the target. Your people are missing. Open the hatch. Something like this, and then just rotate out. Give us a heading. All right, we're coming in one by one. Keep it away from my sculptures. This will be the last one. Workforce transfer disrupted. Open the bay doors. All right, we'll come in then with the big battleships. So it's one by one every time. Oh my God! They even took down the ship. 
Oh my god, the battleships aren't even needed here. Holy crap. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Holy crap. Survive, survive, survive. Oh no. They're gonna go down. I'm coming back with my airships to take out those two and also pick up those bombs we just dropped. But that's Benty's Island retaken. Alright, we picked up the bombs at least, but it didn't feel good losing the guys. That was crazy. The bombs were so effective. It's crazy how good they are. It'd be great to do that on his capital then as a final thing. Work All right. Just for fun, let's see what we can pick up. Your Some of these battleships. Are starting to get sick. Uh, right, where are we at? Embasa, there's still a couple more to go, and then we'll wrap up the episode. So I might go a bit long on this one just till we get this done. Cape Trelawney, we're ready to attack that as well now. We'll just brighten up the day. That's a different noise, it must be the flat guns, but they sound different than they had before. Sounded like little MP40s or something. Just realized he sounds quite like Christopher Walken. <laughs> Alright, just this last one, and then warehouse, and then we're on to that big one over there. But I did say I'll just keep going until the Embasa is done. And then once he's dead, we can release these islands, release the ones we don't want. Now you've got more islands than me. Mm hmm. Alright, we're circling in. New World are still making fresh airships, right? I think? No. We're out of influence now, so any airship we lose, we won't get back until the next propaganda run. Because all of our influence has gone to the newspaper. Awaiting orders. Let's see what we picked up. Really just nothing. Nothing worth having anyway. That's in base up. You will never fully appreciate it. I see you're exploring yet more options. All right, great. Get back over here, heal for a bit. Let's go back to Mbesa. There are two islands left. Moving to coordinates. It's gonna take a little while to get up to them because we're against the wind, actually. Two airships here. I didn't actually remember doing that. I vaguely do, but just forgot, I guess, momentarily that we did do it. Might send them back, actually, to the New World to go pick up some bombs or something. They won't really be able to do anything against a squadron of four on their own. Although they're sitting next to defenses that'll help. Thinking about it, the defenses are all destroyed. Uh-oh, I think I'm out of guns as well, am I? Oh no, the influence! Oh shit, you can't actually repair them. Yeah, you two get the hell out of here. Go to the New World. We'll pick up your bombs and sea mines. Alright, that's going to take a while. I might speed up time then for that. But in the meantime, we'll hop over to Cape Trelawney. Go for this next one. So I'm on times two speed, not times three, but just a little bit quicker. And then we need to, next episode, definitely have to go to the Arctic. Send this fleet up to the Arctic so they can take out the airship buildings there. Fire. 
All right, we're almost done. There's actually not many defenses here. Did I send that monitor in anyway? I, no, I did send it back. Good. Your people are miserable. There's something hitting me that I can't see. No. They must have more defenses. Oh yeah, they do around that way. All right, that's the harbor master taken care of. We'll just zoom around, take out these little buildings here, and then that should be that for this island. And this is his biggest one in Cape Trelawney. Like to close the gap so we can obviously throw down our Forget abilities. Done. You 34 influence for that place. Holy crap. God, it was so loud. All right, good. Now you've got more islands than me. Oh, I lost my ship. Oh, it got taken out. Damn. Damn. Oh well. One of the uh, Uza flak monitor. Not too bad. Uh, and looking at this as well, it seems like our blue flame monitors are gone as well. So we're losing ships, taking attrition. What the hell is that? I don't know what that was. <laughs> so we have a flak monitor and a flak monitor, and the blue flame ones are the ones that went down. Okay. Moving to coordinates. Not much left to go. These next islands won't have much defenses, actually, so... We're going to head Fleet back to base, to and then we can head out to that one. But that'll be in the next episode. Back in Embesa, we're ready to go for the second to last island. Wonder what's gonna happen to his airships if he's just gonna leave them or send them out. I'm gonna send my ships back to Mbesa. We're gonna go for a big Your air battle in the next one too. From its voyage. Fleet on the moon. Fire! Oh my god, I clicked the wrong damn button. So I won't be able to take this for a while. Uh, that's so silly. I clicked claim shares. It doesn't really matter. It, we can still get it next one. How long does that last, the temporary ceasefire? I don't know. We'll get a timer on it eventually, and then it just means we'll come back and take it. Oh, uh, clicking the wrong button. So silly. Fleet ready. All right, just one more to go then. Now, when you claim all the shares, you can just pay a little influence to buy the last piece anyway, so... Moving to fire there is also up. that. Fleet on the moon. All right, last one in Embesa. I'm just going to look away for a moment. The ships that were supposed to the come up here... Simply had to come down. Yeah, they're all here. Embarking. They're just going to pick up some stuff. That's in basic done. You will never fully appreciate it. In fact, before they pick it up, I think I'll just send them right now straight to in basic. We'll have that air battle. Already there. So they all arrive at the same time. So in the next episode at the beginning, ships are going to arrive basically down here. We'll have to keep this fleet here just for, I think it's like 30 minutes in order to take this out or just to buy it out. Start the takeover. You will never oh. fully appreciate it. Oh, that's it then. He's done. Now well, we'll come we'll have our air battle here anyway, but we can leave, we can take this fleet out now, so this fleet doesn't have to be here anymore. So we're going to send these... I don't know. Maybe they could go to Cape Trelawney and mop up the small islands now, now that it's just small things left, actually, yeah. And the ones in Cape Trelawney, they're the battleships. Your they ship can uh, go to the old world point. or go to the new world. Sorry, Arctic, and handle that final island up there, actually. The fire left ruins behind. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. So you guys stay together as a group. Get to the Arctic. Get to King William Island. And that means that once we're done the Arctic, once we're done then down the here, broke out. it'll be a convergence on the old world to deal with his final island. So that's the idea. The fire 
left ruins behind. So some of our airships have already arrived here in Tabarim, but we're going to wait for them all to arrive before we fight that air battle, and that will be at the beginning of the next the episode. Left so ruins a little behind. bit disjointed, a little messy, these episodes. I'm just going island to island, destroying them. But you get it. It's got to be done this way. All right, and then we have the rebuilding effort once we're done in the next one. All right, so that's going to have to be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching the video. Consider liking it if you enjoyed it, subscribe for more, and if you want to support even further, consider becoming a channel member. Channel members get early access to my videos ad-free, and also access to my Discord, where we've just set up a new Valheim and Satisfactory server for people to play on. Hopefully we can grow a community and add more games and perks in the future. Either way, I appreciate people just watching this far into the video. Thank you.